So what's your biggest takeaway? Alabama, in my opinion, is still number one. Alabama is the best all-round football team in the nation. Offense, defense, and kick game. And again, remember, they beat number three, Florida State, when they were really Florida State. Yes. That's, that's a great football team, Alabama. The, the, the metrics and the resume, yeah. I guess, is what's holding them back. I'm with you. I think they're the top team in the country. Uh, the thing that stood out to me is that the committee, congratulations, that they have some unbeatens, like Wisconsin and like Miami, down there at 9 and 10. Yeah. And they've got six teams with one loss up ahead of them. I think for some people that's confusing because we've been trained over the years with the AP poll and the coaches poll that hey, if you're undefeated you can't be better you should be higher yeah. but the committee did it right and they looked at resumes and also just the way these teams are playing those one loss teams should be up there yeah I, I agree and then head-to-head -head matters mm -hmm. I, I, I absolutely love that what, what the heck's the point in playing the game if head-to-head -head doesn't matter and again it's not when there's three losses and one loss does it's right. when it's one loss and one loss head-to-head yeah. -head should matter and they did that with Oklahoma and they did that with uh, with Notre Dame um, and Georgia too as Unlike well. Coach, I was happy that they um, that they were able to reward Georgia for their resume. I thought that Georgia deserved to be the number one team, I, and they didn't get caught up in the hype of you know Alabama being the top team. And Notre Dame, I was really happy to see Notre Dame in the top four too, because I also thought that they deserved to be in that spot at number, yeah. at number three.